I have the Ring Chime Pro here. I'm going to show you how to set this up step by step. Now the reason why I had to get this is because even though the doorbell rings on the outside, nothing rings on the inside and you can't get a ring tone or a ring on your actual base. You have to get one of these additional um, devices. So I got the Chime Pro here. So the first thing is go ahead and open up your Chime or your uh, Ring app. So I'm going to open up my Ring app here. Top right hand side, those three horizontal lines, let's tap on that. And let's go down here where it says set up a device. Let's tap on that. And then we have the chimes. So we're going to go ahead and tap on right here, chimes. Let's tap on that. Now we need the QR code. Now the QR code comes in this, uh, there's two places you can get the QR code. It's on the pamphlet that comes out of your box is right there. Or you even have one that's on back of the Chime Pro itself. Okay. So first thing is I'm going to go ahead and plug this in just like that. And you also have the option down here. It says set up without scanning. Anyway, I'm going to click on try again, and then I'm going to go ahead and get the QR code. I'll just use this one that was on here. And let's go ahead and get that. All right. So that's the location that I want. That's perfect. Let me tap on continue down here. Then from here, I'm going to tap on continue. Give your chime a name. You can go upstairs, downstairs. You can even create a custom. Okay, for me, I'm fine. I'm just going to put down hallway right there. Then it says uh, Chime Pro is on. It is on. Let me tap down here. And then from here, it says next, grab your pass Wi-Fi password. Let's go and tap on next right here. Now it says wait up to two minutes for the Chime Pro to get ready. Once the light on the front begins flashing green, continue to the next step. So it is flashing green right here. So I'm going to tap down here. The light is flashing green. When prompt, connect ring Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to tap down here. Got it. Ring wants to join this network here. I'm going to tap on join. Connecting your Chime Pro. Dear Chime Pro. Now I'm going to connect to the Wi-Fi network here. I'm going to tap on right there. Chime Pro is connecting to your Wi-Fi network. Six success right now. I'm going to tap on continue. And it, uh, she did say that there is a update performing right now. From here, we're going to tap on continue. Which alerts should your Chime Pro amplify? You can skip for now. You can do it do it now. Select alerts. I'm going to go ahead and do it now. I'm going to select alerts right there. So you have two things here. When the front door rings, you can, if you want the Chime to ring, when the front door rings, the Chime will ring. And also you can do motion right here as well. For me, I'm just fine with just the, uh, the ring, the Chime ring when somebody rings the doorbell. Okay, so from here I'm going to go ahead and tap on continue. Link devices, save set, uh, settings saved, so I'm going to tap on continue. Let's connect a ring device to your Chime Pro network. I'm going to go ahead and tap on continue down here. Waiting for the update to complete here. So the night light just turned on, which is uh, one of the differences between the, uh, the, chime, the regular Chime versus this new Chime Pro. All right, it just said complete. Now it says connect devices with weak signal to your Chime Pro network. So I'm going to go ahead and tap down here. You can always skip for now, but I'm going to go ahead and proceed. Let me tap on that. And it says here, switching this device to your Chime Pro network may improve its connection, okay, versus your home Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to go down here. I'm going to switch to Chime Pro network. Let's tap on that. And down here it says front door has a strong Wi-Fi connection. Okay, let me go ahead and connect the Chime Pro down here. So let's wait for ring doorbell to enter setup mode. So we want to uh, make sure that the light on the front starts spinning white. Continue to the next step, okay? So they're not talking about the chime itself with the um, spinning white. It's actually on the ring doorbell itself. And we can see that it is spinning circle. So we do see the spinning circle, the light, the white. So I'm going to go ahead and tap down here and give that one second. Chime connecting. is working for your ring device. Chime Pro is setting up your Ring device. It's now set up and connected to your Chime Pro. And snapshot, snapshot capture here. You can go ahead and read through this and go ahead and tap on here. Got it. Success, your Ring doorbell is now set up and ready to protect you. Tap on continue right there. And from here we can go ahead and tap on I'm done. Chime Pro network setting saved. Tap on continue. 
Let's test the connection quality of your Chime Pro. You can go ahead and skip for now, or you can do the run the test now. Let's go ahead and run it now. I get a good connection up here. Same with the doorbell. I'm going to go ahead and tap on next. Which alert tones should this Chime Pro play? You can go ahead and skip for now, or you can go ahead and select it now. So we'll go ahead and select tones here. I'm going to go ahead and stick with the uh, default. But you have other ones. But I like this ring default one right here. So I'm going to go ahead and save and continue right there. Increase and decrease the volume up there. I'm good with all these right here. I'm going to click on save and continue. Chime tones saved. Tap on continue. And from here we can tap on I'm done. And we'll give it a test ride. Doorbell. So this is working now, as you can see. Good luck, guys.